I'm Blake. I'm Asa. And we have done the solar oven. Yes, the solar oven. And so what we have here is some uh, ba a baking kind of thing. Uh, a plastic right here to get make the sunlight to shine in there. Yes, to keep it in. And uh, Blake, would you care to explain what's inside? Inside we have the wall covered with aluminum foil, and this is actually really hot right now. Um, covered with aluminum foil to make it hotter in there. And we have an egg that is gonna fry, hopefully. And we'll see how it works. And, and the egg is inside a pan. And also another thing we did is that we made sure that no sunlight or heat can escape when we take all possible exits for the uh, sunlight. And this is actually getting pretty warm yeah. right now. And we got some black tape to make sure that it stays there. And also, I don't know if y'all can see it, but in there is some black paper wrapped around a, a pot. And I can see the egg, it's kind of uh, working. And hopefully this thing works. Film right here uh, that's keeping this thing up, uh, this heat in, is how oh, might come up every once in a while due to convention convection currents inside of the uh, of the box because the heat will rise and then it'll get cold, come back down, heat will rise, and then it'll be an infinite loop of heat and cold inside the box. And there's a bee that's coming to check out our box. Our solar oven. And this film thing that we have is easy to remove. <laughs> Like, this is going to be in front of our science teacher. Look at Blake. So that was Blake dabbing. And now, uh, we're, we just got to sit here and wait for our egg to fry. We can leave and come back later. Probably. Um, once this egg is fried, uh, hopefully... Like, we'll eat it. What now? Hello! Hi. <laughs> this Lake ya. And Asa, and this is our second solar oven. Now, some changes we did from the first one, which uh, we added fell over. this really cool Lid. top. That's gonna. What happened to your first one? It, it, fell, it over. fell over, and it didn't quite work. And we have uh, some black tape around it to insulate. Uh, and the, the most heat. important part, the duck symbol. Yes, that's. We're calling this uh, the the duck project and if we need to if the sun would say is over there we can angle this to aim into there yes like let's do it like this you can angle it and then if when I whenever we're doing whenever we're heating it we can keep it closed and since we have the what we have on the inside is the foil that's coming in, and I don't know what happened here, but it just exploded. Oh. And as you can see, we have our egg inside. Anyway, and We're then we have it for a little while, and we have it angled towards the sun. Right here is actually really, really, really hot. So it's gonna absorb and keep in the heat. And I just saw some kind of spider going. And now, keep in mind that this light or not kind not late but like later in the day in the afternoon and the which sun is, is right there which right is not there. really recommended uh, for whenever we do these things but i think it's gonna work and blake's going to i bet you it's the skateboard but uh, the outside of the box is actually really hot hopefully we can do this and if you're wondering why we chose black tape 
is because that black absorbs heat and, and it will absorb it in and also it will keep it from coming out and and instead of uh, just putting oil all around this uh, we decided to put black on the back so that way it can come in from the top check the egg and it's actually kind of getting hot outside for me since I'm wearing a black shirt which by the way has an awesome pun find it find it right there we're gonna check in later to see if anything happened to this egg and I wonder why we're both wearing socks and not shoes Our egg project is finally working, and I know this because the condensation right here is water on top from probably steam, and the sunlight is hitting the pan, which is causing conduction because it's metal, that's a good conductor, it's going to travel to the egg and fry it. And also the um, egg from last time is kind of already cooked. So we'll check on this egg later. Hello. Hello. So our egg has finally cooked and we're gonna see the results after you tear it open. Not tear it, but conveniently open it. Open it. Uh oh. Nobody cares. Well, I'll do. It's the most I can open it. Oh, oh, it's so hot in here. Come feel it. Ah! Feel it. Feel it. Like really. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> now that thing's burning hot. The egg. It's cooked somewhat. There's crusty stuff in there. I think that the reasoning why this egg cooked, <laughs> it's hard. Well, I think the reason why this egg cooked is because this is a metal pan. It's pretty yep. obvious, but the, uh, the heat came in and it was conducting all over this because it's metal. Also, and it also another cooked. reason why I think it cooked well, is the design before wasn't really that good, okay. and it uh, it didn't have That's anything fine. around the outside. I think the insulator helped a lot, and so did the lid. I'm Asa. His name is Blake, and, and that was our that was our solar oven. Boy.